Hey everyone, it's Sam here today and I'm going to be telling you six DIY spot treatments. So these are for acne to help get rid of acne faster and for some of you it might work overnight. So I like to do these and I like to put them onto a band-aid and then sleep with them and then it helps to shrink the acne and just make it look less red and puffy and inflamed overnight. So the first one is honey. I love honey. I love the way it feels and it's just very good antibacterial like all of these DIYs. They're very good to clean out and dry out the pimple because that's the number one way acne forms is by clogged pores and oily skin. So the second one is aloe vera gel. You can use it straight from the plant or the bottle. I like using the plant because I have one but if you can't that's okay. And once again I put it onto a band-aid and then put it onto the acne. And aloe vera gel feels really great because it's really cooling and soothing. So if it really hurts, if it's like a really big painful pimple, then it feels really good onto that. And the next one, the third one, is tea tree oil. You do have to dilute this because it's very, very strong and the essential oil is very, very concentrated, but it's very good for um, killing acne because it's so antibacterial and cleaning, but do not use it by itself because I've done that before and it actually kind of broke me out worse because it was so strong, it kind of like really gave me kind of a rash. So you do want to dilute it with a little bit of water and it works wonders. The fourth one is apple cider vinegar. This is also very acidic. It balances our pH. So yeah, that's also a plus and it's just acidic and all acidic things are good for only acne, just specific pimple because it is very, very cleaning and drying to it and the point of getting rid of acne is to dry it out but you don't want to use this all over your face just plain. You want to dilute it a little bit. And then the next one is toothpaste. You've probably heard this one. It's not super recommended because it's toothpaste, it's not for your face, but it is actually good to dry it out because it is cleaning once again. And A lot of um, toothpastes have baking soda in it and baking soda is also good for acne. And then the last and final one, I believe, is you can use a face mask. So for me, I have a Lush face mask and sometimes I use that as a spot treatment because it's good for overall acne, so it's good as a spot treatment. The whole point of a spot treatment, in my opinion, is something that you put in one spot and that you let it sit for a longer time than you would like a face mask or a moisturizer or something. So yeah, those are my six DIY spot treatments. Honey, apple cider vinegar, aloe vera gel, um, toothpaste, face mask, and tea tree oil. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed. Hopefully you'll try these out. And tell me which one works the best for you if you try any of them out. And tell me in the comments below. And make sure you subscribe. I have lots of DIY videos that are related to this. And I also have lots of actual DIYs that are like craft stuff. So make sure to check it all down below. And make sure to like and subscribe. And thank you for watching. See you soon. Bye. And it actually balances our P... P... No. <laughs>